Well, we were the first in the country to be completely transparent about where everybody's recycling goes. And we're really pleased that last year we had the best results we've ever seen. So 98% of everything we collected from recycling at the curbside, at our recycling centres, it all stayed in the UK. That's thanks to our crews out on the street. It's thanks to the staff at recycling centres. But most importantly, it's thanks to everybody at home sorting their recycling, putting it in the right place. That means we can keep it in the UK, recycle it properly. Obviously, that's a hugely impressive number. Two um, percent. What proportion of that? You know, how much is that two percent, and um, whereabouts is that going? Well, half of everything we collect it stays in Somerset. As I say, about ninety-eight percent stays in the UK. Ninety-nine point four percent of everything plastic stays in the UK. So that's really important to us and to everybody else because everybody's seen the horror stories. Uh, so it's a really small amount. The total recycling we collected is about 137,000 tonnes. The reality is, though, you know, people, reprocessors in the UK want quality material. If we occasionally have some small bits of material that don't quite meet those high quality standards or there isn't enough capacity in the UK and so they have to go abroad. But that's why we put all that effort in the crews and the public to sorting material, because that means we can keep it in the UK. What exactly does happen to waste in Somerset? Once it's taken away from our homes, where does it go? Well, most of people's black bin rubbish goes now goes to an energy from waste plant up in Avonmouth rather than going to a hole in the ground and storing up a problem for the future. It's not the perfect solution. I wish we didn't have any rubbish, but it's the it's the best place we can take it at the moment. The recycling goes to various places. Half of it stays in Somerset, so all of your food waste, all of your garden waste, and then we'll we'll move it around the country. Uh, making sure we take it to the best possible place wherever we can keep it locally we do so if you give us back one of our broken recycling boxes for example that will stay um, in Somerset too so keeping it as close to home as possible. We've all seen those stories of um, you know those pictures of waste abroad and some people might say well why am I recycling if it's just going to end up in a landfill in another country do you feel this kind of information may help to change people's behaviours and certainly their attitudes. We hope so. That's exactly why we share this information. We were the first to do so in the country. I think everybody around the country should should have a right to know this and have confidence that nearly everything you give us, we keep in the UK, we recycle properly, we save as much carbon as taking almost 50,000 vehicles off the road. That's thanks to everybody in Somerset. It's thanks to our hardworking staff. So, yeah, I think it's really important that we are open and honest back to the public so they know that their efforts aren't wasted.